What if I bought two? Uh, what if you want two peso, I can do four once. Okay, what's up guys? Saudi Cap. Paul here with this new YouTube vlog. Down here at the Padia Night Bazaar. Ironically, here in the morning. It's, well, midday here on Sunday afternoon. Place already opened, so it actually opens like 11 to 11. But currently because of the coronavirus lockdown and the drop in footfall, I've been told it is closing around 7 p.m. So ever since my first ever backpacking trip to Thailand at like 22 years old, I've always liked the fun and ambiance of the bazaars. The one in Chiang Mai, I used to get a lot of football jerseys and jean shorts and cool fake trainers for good cheap cheap prices you know fun quick shopping when you're not uh, in the market for you know Gucci and Versace when you just want to have some cool quick trainers bazaars are the places to come so let's go inside the patio night bazaar and see what we can find yeah I got Oh hello. Got some trainers in here. Okay. That's a cool t-shirt, huh? Are you watching that UFC fight? I was, yes. Yeah, just Adesanya and uh, Costa, yeah? Yes. Title fight. What happened? Uh, Israel just won, uh, second round, a minute or so into it. Uh, knocked Jeez. him out, ground and pound, really good. Yeah. Superb. Yep. There was a lot of shit talking building up to that, wasn't yeah, it? Was, it? Costa was, was giving a lot. Uh, yeah. Israel, Israel's the man, he's another level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Fantastic. you were with Erkaf and you're Aussie, eh? Yes, yes I am. Yes. So they fought already, did they? They fought, Israel beat him, he did very well. Um, I just think Israel is just a completely yeah. different level. You're a big fan, eh? Yeah? Like you at MMA fan in general? MMA fan, yeah. There's big Dana. Um, yeah, <laughs> That's like Dana. quality on your camera. Did, is that Fight Pass? Did uh, you buy that? Yes, I am. Yeah, with your Fight Pass. Quality. Yeah. Really um, good HD quality, isn't it? Yes, yeah, superb. Good. Mm. Good. Very good. Very good. Nice, nice. TV's on the blink, so I've got it on the phone. Ah, uh, you have a TV here. <laughs> is this your story, eh? Yes, yes, nice, yes. Yeah. What do you think of um, Lightweight? Khabib Gaethje coming soon, isn't it? Uh, Khabib Gaethje, um, I'm going with Khabib. It's yeah. 28 no, 29 30. It's going to happen. Um, mm, I love Khabib, man. He's another level altogether. Yeah. He's, um, Difficult for him, though, like with his personal circumstances. You know, his father indeed, died. Yeah. Indeed, but you know what? This is a true testament to his uh, ability. Big time, yeah. Um, but Gaethje, Gaethje has skills. Gaethje is going to give him some run yeah. for his money on the ground. Khabib's probably just a bit too good for him, though, right? Yeah, I agree. Do you think McGregor's ever coming back? Yes. You think he's going to come back? Yeah, he'll, uh, he'll probably he do... Just, he just tweeted yesterday he wants to fight yeah, Pacquiao, Pacquiao and box. I mean, come on. Look, Pacquiao's going to smash him. 41 year old boxer? Yeah, yes. he's going to smash him, though. But these exhibition stuff, it's like, how serious can he be about MMA anymore if he's doing all these half retirements? Look, I just don't think his heart's in it anymore. And which is fair enough, because uh, was it a, a famous boxer said it's hard to get punched in the face when you're wearing diamond slippers. Yeah, correct. Something to that effect. All right, we got some beautiful artwork here. John Lennon, Freddie Mercury, is that Bon Jovi, I want to say. I don't know who this is. Oliver Reed. Leave it into the comments if you know who this is. You actually see a lot of beautiful artwork in Patia. Oh, we got Joaquin Phoenix's Joker, Keith Richards, wow, really nice stuff, Mick Jagger, Keith Ledger's Joker, why so serious? Wow, some mud. 
Mad Max stuff here. Check this stuff out. Wow. Some apocalyptic gothic shit right here. I wonder is this just ornaments or can you buy this when the shop opens? The store is called Kong Long Apicha. All this apocalyptic macabre decor we're checking out. I need but one email. Alright guys, I'm here with Shaha from Melbourne, Australia and he runs this nice uh, toy store called Uncle Toys. Uncle Toys, alright mate. Your so. favourite uncle always brings you toys. So. <laughs> so I see you got all the frozen stuff, the kids love that, right? Yeah, absolutely, uh, ranging from ages all the way from sort of six months to even adults with drones and, and some pretty cool... Uh, you got drones? Yeah. Oh, nice, nice. Control, you want to uh, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm in the market for a drone, man. Like, Absolutely. Just talking to you off camera about like YouTube equipment. Absolutely. That's a toy I really need to get my hands on. Yeah, so we've got some drones. Um, Big up Curry, NBA fan? I am. Yeah. <laughs> Big sports fan. I've just been talking to Shaha about fan. MMA, man. Me too. I'm, I'm football, but yep. uh, I like a bit of basketball, of course. As well. Absolutely. Can't, nice. can't go wrong with a bit of basketball. So these are drones, man. Jesus. Yes. Wow. Yeah, so uh, good ranges on them. Um, some of them have uh, the homing beacon, which means they can basically return to base. Uh, makes life a lot easier. Oh, yeah. For, yeah, I've for seen a few. Flyer. Seen um, a few people crashing. Yeah, this all is drones. drones disappear. Um, <laughs> have you ever heard crash them? Yeah, crash disappear. Do you absolutely. play around with them? Do you make yes, content? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah? I, I use every single toy here. That way, I can, you know, express the good part and the bad yeah. part about and do you, it. And do you post content about uh, them? Occasionally. Mm. Um, Occasionally on my Instagram and, and other bits and pieces, but mostly it's the um, the shoppers that come through. Mm. Uh, being Thailand, we've got a lot of foreigners that need to buy gifts for their family. Mm -hmm. So um, that's what we're here to service and help with. Yeah, man, great. So, like, do you want to recommend one particular drone, like, yeah, for, in terms of quality to price? Sure. Um, so you got, so got 4K camera on the um, on the JA888. Mm. Uh, 2.4 gigahertz, um, six-axis gyro. Um, with a homing beacon, so it actually returns to your to the controller. Wow! Um, like, as in, how what kind of distance can it go? Hundred meters. Oh, sorry. Okay, you yeah. may say that. Yeah. So, um, greatest part about it is um, kids don't lose their toy or this drone um, simply because at a hundred meters it'll just simply mm. um, focus down, um, just power down slowly and just hit the ground safely, um, and then it can go and pick it up. Um, Brilliantly, with any of the drones that I carry, I make sure they have a self-hovering system built in. Uh, that way, when you are flying it, if you just let go of your controls, it will stay exactly where it is. Panning like drone yeah. beach footage, yeah. Yep. Um, so, do you want to just reiterate price range again? So, from yeah, the most absolutely. expensive to cheapest? Yeah, I'm, I've got them at, at a decent, um, decent mid-range point. Um, I haven't gone for the cheapy cheapy because I want people to enjoy what they're using. Cheapy um, cheapy. Yeah. Um, <laughs> they but, toast up. Walk yeah. walk. Uh, but these guys... You go walk walk mate? Yeah 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 absolutely. Where walk, you walk walk? walk. <laughs> you um, walk walk on the beach I walk mate? walk everywhere everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. Um, okay. So these guys here are 1500 baht, 1500 baht. That's cheap cheap. Um, it is pretty good. I, I was expecting more to be honest. Yep yeah, and these guys here a uh, very similar unit just slightly bigger. Uh, but camera usage and everything's identical between the two, 1,200 baht. That's all they so, cost? Yep. Yeah. Oh, geez, I'm right. throwing them away. Literally. Oh, I, I, <laughs> daylight robbery, man. Like, yeah. Call yeah. the cops. Call the take police the in here, man. There's robbery taking so place in this and, store. Uh, we'll take care of all your uh, toy needs. Daylight robbery, man. Cuff me if I buy this, man, because I am, I'm getting a steal out of this. Done. Um, 14, 1500. Like, but in general, like not to yeah. big yourself up too much, but aren't they like? They, I, I figure drones are five, six, seven thousand yeah, more range. Yeah, absolutely can. Um, I've got them at what I believe to be what a consumer should pay for a product. I'm not trying to make a million bucks out of the first sale. Mm. I'm looking at volume as opposed to, you know, the one purchase and durability. Like, yeah, absolutely. What, That's what my are, main focus. We're going to get a few years out of it. Like, two here. Yep. I don't know enough um, about them. To, I'm only asking. Sure. Like, yeah. Your battery life will last you no less than two years. That's on a recharge on a daily basis if you happen to use it. So that's a really good lithium battery. That's the same for both. I've chosen these two for a number of reasons, uh, but most of it um, is simply because they last. Nice, simple man. As that. Good quality. Yo, guys, you got to come good down change. and check out Shahaz Uncle Toys. Listen to the passion with which he speaks about his drones. The guy knows his stuff, and he's set a good price because he's 
he believes in quality content and, mm -hmm. and having fun with toys, yeah? Absolutely. <laughs> all right, mate, 100%. thanks so much. No worries at all. Cheers, Mocha. All right, so I'm on the lookout for some crepes, some trainers. Oh, hi, mate. Hello, sir. Hey, how's it going? Shoes you like, sir? Oh, you got a lot of cool yeah. shoes. You got the Balenciaga, different color Yeezy. Sir. So we got ten and a half UK. That's a big one. Forty-five and a half Europe. You know what they say about got with big feet, big socks. Oh, 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 box fresh. Oh, oh. 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 oh, can you get full body on that? Full body? Sure, sir. Yeah, full body, sir. You're pretty cool, right? This is so comfortable. Feels great. How much are they going to be? Uh, 900 bucks. 100, okay. Yeah. yeah. You, you, you don't want this Oh, uh, alright then. Uh, how about 700? You do 700? Uh, so this model cannot, sir. Like uh, this price camera, not too much, so I can get no. out for sale, sir. Really? Really, sir? This price camera, 900 baht, little big discount, sir. Like All right, how about, how about we do 900? Uh, 900 baht, okay, sir. Okay, it's good to have those. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> All right, so, Crepe Check. Bought the Yeezys from the lads here at the Shoe and Bag store in Patia Noi Bazaar. Paid 900 baht. And happy to do so, yeah. I'm not going to sit here and haggle these guys down from the price. They're doing their best to make sales here at a difficult time in Thailand with the coronavirus lockdown, meaning there's very little tourist footfall. So yeah, just had a bit of fun there with a fake haggle. You know, that's kind of the done thing in the bazaars is that you uh, haggle over the price, but I'm definitely not going to do that for these quality, easy trainers. Cheers guys, hope you enjoyed the video at Paddy and Night Bazaar and lots more videos dropping over the next couple of weeks, yeah? Thanks guys, cheers.